we're the festival in Toronto that kind of tries to represent everything. If you are interested in music in any way, Toronto Summer Music is the place for you. Nothing can replicate the creation of, of sound by four unique individuals. I think opening night is a great one. The Escher Quartet is one of the kind of world's up and coming string quartets and they're just incredible. They sound great. I think one of the unique things about our quartet is our um, sense of sound. We really like to hear four distinct voices that enhance each other as opposed to blend into each other. So I don't ever really feel like I have to be somebody else or, you know, playing second violin, so I have to like try to only play in you know, a certain way I can really be who I am. started talking about L'Histoire de Soldat and creating a fully staged version of it about two years ago. I'm really excited to see what Elena has put together. And fast forward two years later and we're now doing it at the Travis Center Music Festival. Jen Nichols is coming, she'll be the dancer and she's going to act the part of the princess. And I'm really excited for this one because it's a little bit out of my comfort zone. My production inspiration for this piece has been based on two painters. Um, one is uh, Marc Chagall is a French painter, and then Jean-Michel Basquiat. And it's a very powerful, aggressive piece that depicts a devil's head. I'm working with Cameron Davis, who is a projection designer. The presence of the devil is being indicated in the projections and in the lighting. I think the mix of kind of having a dancer, having projections, you know, I think it's the whole multimedia event is going to come together really nicely. We're the festival in Toronto that kind of tries to represent everything. We do classical music, we do jazz, we do education. We've got a group of young fellows from all around the world that come in and learn from the great artists that are here. It's actually great too because when we're here we're put in ensembles with some of the students. So I feel like we're actually really a part of the festival, not just sort of playing our own concert and then going home. We have a community academy which is set for adult amateurs to come in and again learn from the mentors that we have. Playing with students is the best way for them to learn because they have immediately have a sound in their head and sometimes they can exceed their own expectations for themselves when they're in that context. I think specifically this year we're commemorating the 100th anniversary of the end of World War I. And a lot of the music that we are going to be presenting kind of takes that in, into account. Uh, I think the first one we're playing is the Schumann uh, first string quartet. The second piece will be Shostakovich uh, string quartet number nine. And the last piece will be, I think, Tchaikovsky first string quartet. So there should be something for everybody. And some people come to every single concert in the festival and some people pick and choose. And the idea is that you can look through and you can find something that suits what you want to go to. I think that there's, there's a slight Russian theme in this program, which it'll be very nice to hear the contrast, actually, between the Shostakovich and the Tchaikovsky. You, know, you, you really get to, in, to enjoy his really beautiful melodies. And... It's really lovely. I mean, we, we haven't performed yet, but we'll see how it goes tomorrow. <laughs>